Yo guys, what's up? Shishui here, back with another video. I'm telling you guys how to get infinite skills in Attack on Titan Revolution. First off, you're gonna need Titan Shifting and you're gonna need the new Clan Fritz. And these are very important because you cannot do without them. So if you don't have them, click off this video. First off, you're gonna need Swift Strikes that eliminates up to five nearby Titans. This is very important. Next, you're gonna want Rage Mode to build up your Rage Bar, activating more health, ODM speed, and health regen. This way all your cooldowns also reset. Next thing that you're gonna need is Let It Rip, which turns yourself into a Blade Blade and spin to your heart's content. Also, you're gonna want the Fence Perk slot and Titan Shifting, obviously. So if you don't have those, go get them. Now the perks that I'm showing you here are not needed, but I highly recommend them because the faster you are, the easier it is for you to be able to get these kills and for you to be able to zip around the map like it's no problem. You also wanna be able to one-shot Titans, and if you have that one perk that gives you a 25% faster awakening bar for your titan shifting, that is absolute must to be honest. You absolutely need that. Having the cloak as well also gives you more aggro around the area so titans will just come to you instead of you having to go to them much farther. This just makes things much easier and also faster to get your awakening bar and rage bar. Now obviously, first off what you're going to want to do, get a bunch of titans around you so this way you can kill as many as possible. After that, you're going to want to use your skills, like both Let It Rip, the Blade Blade mood, and you're going to want to use Swift Strikes to kill any nearby Titans nearby. Right after you do that, if you have enough in your Rage Bar, activate your Rage moves, this way you get both your Blade Blade and your Swift Strikes back, use them right again to get a full Awakening Bar, and then right after you do that, get to the nearest Titans or anything like that, just make sure you keep your Rage Bar going, this way it's almost near to full. And as soon as you get to the other titans, immediately switch into your titan shifting mode and activate it. Doing this will give you back full HP and it'll take away your rage mode. So this way when you go back into human form, your rage mode will be gone and you'll be able to use it straight away again if you need to. But besides that, use all your titan skills, kill any titans nearby, you know, just stay alive I suppose. Once you go out of Titan mode, you're going to want to head back over to the nearest Titans and kill them all again. This way, either using your skills or just killing a little bit without them, it really doesn't matter. You can watch out your skills regen like I did, or you can just switch back into Rage mode. Now obviously, what I'm doing here is just using both my moves again, and then as soon as I kill them, I go straight back into Rage mode so that's why I can get them back, and then I just use them over and over again. I'm pretty sure you already got the idea of it, so what I'm going to do, I'm just let the rest of the video play out. But once again, moves, rage mode, moves again, switch to titan form, switch out of titan form, rage mode, moves. Basically, it's an infinite combo strat, especially you have the one perk that allows you to titan form up to five to six times, whichever one you do have, as long as you can do it multiple times, this will work for you. Now, obviously, I know not all of you have Fritz or Titan Shifting, so I hope you do get it soon. Remember, we're doing a 50k gem giveaway at 5k subs, so sub, like, turn notifications to join the streams. Peace out, and see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.